So I left my 18-inch uh, groom loop in the tub. I am using a 24-inch. So you can see it does still work out here. It just leaves so much room. I prefer to have my arm down lower, but hey, if you got a 24-inch, it still works, right? So we're doing a seven summer cut. Matter of fact, it was not live, but I told David, I was like, this is not taking off a lot, you know. But I asked the mom, I was like, are you I was like, are we doing a haircut here? <laughs> and she's like, yeah. I said, you want to do what we did last time? She goes, yeah. And that was like, okay, great. But it's not taking off a lot. And I would have probably said it could have waited a little longer. But if mom wants a summer cut. You guys know we are pretty near 80 degrees down here in Texas, and it is just, what, still March. So I have a feeling it's going to be a really hot summer this year, and we hardly had anything of a winter. I mean, like, it was very, very light, whereas right now, we, what is that winter storm hitting in Colorado, and they are, like, shut down, everything's shut down. Wyoming's interstates are shut down, and it's a pretty bad storm. So I can't believe we didn't get none of that, you know what I mean? We usually get snow. We haven't gotten snow in like two years. So I'm going back to the weather, which is why we're going to go into a summer cut and why I'm okay with it. Because here in Texas, a dark dog like this, it gets hot fast. So I'm doing a seven blade down. It's an ultra edge. It's not a ceramic. It's doing just fine. You can do ceramic or ultra edge. Ceramic being, I prefer ceramic, but I have both. Okay. And dogs take their tails up with it. Make sure you guys are picking up your grooming mask. So important. I hardly talk about it these days. I forget to talk about it, but I'm always wearing my mask. So make sure if you're working with your pet, whether it's just at home, brushing your dog. If you don't do it outside, especially, you know, you're sitting there brushing your dog. That dander is getting in your airway and you want to make sure you protect your lungs. It ain't coming out. What goes in your body and the lungs is not coming out. It's not like you're going to digest it. Okay. All right. So, uh. I love her little ear. Her ear's got this little flappy thing going on. Thanks, Sophie. All right. Uh, let me go with the tin blade. And let me double check the file. Take notes so you don't have to ask every time they come in. And you can refer, refer back to your notes when you're not sure. Oh, let me see her. Yeah, two guard reverse teddy bear head. All right, so let's just move this over here. So we're going to do two guard reverse teddy bear head. Makio, if you're out there, I'm going to move you this over here so you can see the face. Super duper cute. She's got one lazy one lazy ear and one regular, you know, regular ear. I think it's super duper cute. Thanks, Sophie. For the donation, I appreciate it. So I got a new client coming in later on. I am thinking I'm going to record that. It is a matted Maltese. And, uh, whew, I don't know, man. I'm just, I worked him in from yesterday because I felt like he can't wait and I have I have the ability to work him in unlike some other days where it's really too busy for me to do that. But they have been grooming their dog at home by themselves and they don't do 100%. So over time, which is like a couple years now, the mats just get worse and worse because they never really do get rid of them, right? So if you're grooming your dog at home, I prefer to just ask you, please, please, you know, have a professional get in there or really go take some classes and do it, do it right. Because now he has to come in here and I told him, you coming in one time spending just as much as you would for the whole year of grooming to me is not worth it on the dog because the dog's matted and this and that. And a matted dog is... In my opinion, it is definitely painful to groom for the dog. Okay, get your seven blade. This is too much. No, uh, we got a, we did the seven blade, right? So let me do a ten. 
kind of down the arms here. Get those pads behind the pads here, just clean up a little bit. Any flurries and stuff. Not heavy, just real nice and skin, skin, skin. Do sanitary. Now, if you haven't, if you can't tell, I have already switched to the template. Okay, I'm gonna turn you this way. We'll get the 40 blade out. And I kind of don't trust her all the way yet. I don't know her well enough as our second groom. And I'm just gonna go ahead and put this on because I cannot recall how she did with the nails. I think she did fine, but I'm just gonna be safe. Make sure you guys smash that like button, please. Renee Fisher, are you serious? What the? Wow, man, that was super generous. That's super generous, Renee. <laughs> Thank you so much. Woohoo! David, if you want, you can... Um, I think it's in the description. You can post that square cash app so that 100% goes to the... No, you don't want to do that? 100% goes to it. No? It's there, but we're good. Yeah, it is there. The The link for direct, direct donations mm. is there. What was that? Oh, you just didn't put it. I didn't push it on right. Okay, that's good. Wow, that's awesome, man. She's, I think she wants to see the Maltese. <laughs> she didn't say she could sit on there. No, she didn't. Or the Maltese crew. Maltese. You deserve it. Thanks so much, man. I appreciate it. You say you're very welcome, Dee Dee. Keep taking care of the dogs out there. Oh, thanks, Renee. That's a seriously generous man. Thank you. Okay, okay. I already know where to look. Let me see. I know where to look. And I know that I can see. It's not that bad. Don't look at me like that. Let's see. Yeah, I'm glad I muzzled you. I believe we got one. Uh, one. We got an offline donation? Yeah. I didn't hear a ding or anything. That's why. Mary Sheldon. How much? 25. Wow. Do you have the same move? Okay, stop, stop. I understand. I do understand, okay? No, it just gives a, you know. Someone uh, gave a, a donation. offline donation, so thank you very much. It's 25. Appreciate you. Sugar, sugar, you're okay. You're okay. Yeah, I know what I'm looking for. I know what I'm looking for. Yeah, yeah, you're okay. <laughs> no, can't go anywhere. We have to do this. Good job. My, my voice got her attention over there on the other side. <clears throat> I'm getting hot, man. And it's like March. How is this possible right now? Renee says she wishes she could watch the Maltese, but she has to get to work. <laughs> All right, great. I, then I don't owe Renee anything. <laughs> Thanks, Renee. Looks like something like bye, Sophie. Okay, I like to pull these apart. Pull your cotton balls apart. So you're not too wasteful out there if you don't need to be. So you're cleaning here. And she's got some eye boogers. We're going to take it out in the bath. All right, me and you, man, we're going to the bath. Yes, we are. All right, we'll be right back. I'll move you guys in just a second here. Ready? Up.
I got the bath. You do? Great. Yes. I already cleaned your ears. Please be sure not to get water in your ears. Are you sure you're not working on something right now? I ain't working on nothing. That's a lie. <laughs> That's a lie. I ain't working on nothing. Stupid. Um, she said something about his ears. What'd you say about his ears? What'd you say about his ears? Added Maltese. Dude. Yeah. That's a bad mix, man. Matted Maltese? Yeah. Yes, it is. I'm not yet. I'm, I'm a little weary. Tell you guys what I'm doing, but I'm just lathering some soap on on it. Don't want to get no water in the ears. That's all. You pretty much have to worry about no water in the ears. How many of you guys out there are groomers? Groomers out there? Are there any groomers out there? Do you bathe your own dog? Or do you have somebody else bathe the dog? Chemical in the shampoo. Lather. You know that. I mean, what do you mean lather? Like, I thought lather. Was lather means when you get the soap, re soap bubbly I all lathered. over the body. Lather. I lathered. Yeah, well, she said it wasn't good enough, but um, I hope that oh. we don't have a shampoo that has a huge amount of lather. It doesn't really get too bubbly. No, that shampoo that, shouldn't. The only one that gets really extremely bubbly. Is the whitening one? The whitening one? Yeah, that one's like. So we should bubbles. see what chemicals in that one. We hardly use that one though. 
this one, like the conditioner doesn't even lather. Like you can't even see any any um bubbles or nothing on there. Mikio said, uh, Mikio was the first one to leave a green heart. <laughs> oh yeah, she was the first yeah. one. How many groomers are out there? Groomers, pet owner. Groomers versus pet owner. I guess I didn't answer, man. I'm not allowed to ask any questions or what? What's he talking about, man? I was wondering how many groomers are out there that bathe their own dogs. Dogs. How many people out there know what kind of shampoo we just used? Who can write down the shampoo we just used? Don't, I'm not going to say anything. I'm going to see how many people know what shampoo that is we used. Don't say it. Yeah. Type of shampoo we used. <laughs> no. Shampoo. Don't do that. <laughs> how many people know what kind of shampoo that is? Uh, we sell a lot of it. Yeah, Caitlin, you would be their groomer, but a pet, you are the pet owner, though. Thank you, Renee! Woohoo! Renee, woohoo! Well, Is that the same Renee donating? What well, Renee? Renee Fisher. She donated again? Let me see, hold on. No, she answered the right... Uh, oh. Yeah, Renee, donated. two Renees donated. Renee Fisher. Renee Fisher needs to email me her mailing address. I'm sending you a free gift. Two Renee's donated. Renee Fisher, who sent a $99.99 and also just answered Rainforest, Pet Silk Rainforest. Renee Fisher, please email me your mailing address. You are getting a gift from okay. Dee. That's exactly no. right. We just used Pet Silk Rainforest shampoo. No. Did you use conditioner too? Yep. Yeah. We love this stuff. Hey. Yep. You guys using the product, it does not lather a lot, does it? It's not a huge lathering shampoo, right? No, it's not. Maybe yeah, make sure you get her eyes good. Mom said she couldn't get it done. No. You need a muzzle? No, no. Need a flea comb? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Lynn Tricky got it right too. Woohoo! Nope, there's no more bather series. That that person is no longer with us, Desiree. We'll start the next one when we get some other help. I'm the new bather series here. Shut up. <laughs> Shut my up. Day, uh, my fifth groomer. <laughs> Whatever. Consists of bathing a dog, blow drying a dog, cleaning the eyes. Can't even sometimes see you, cleaning man. the ears, but Didi sometimes okay. cleans the ears. They don't need Can't. to see the face, man. They oh, don't, they don't. They just need to see the hand. Okay, make sure you put the flea comb up. Don't blow that around, please. Who we'll put that there anyway, man? <laughs> That's where it goes. <laughs> she might not like it. She might not love it. I'm going to start blow drying you guys so if you guys don't like it, you guys can hit the mute real quick or, or lower it a little bit.
And bring her back to the table. muscles she's got here. <laughs> Snaz your body. So she she feels full like she is. you are full aren't to you? The touch. You're so soft. You smell so just delicious. You smell so delicious. Yeah. Hey. Hi. Hey. Hi. Don't you burp? You burp. You're leaning forward a little bit. Let me lower this just a tad. Just a tad for you. Okay, can I get a hug? Can I get a hug? She's a rescue dog. You never know, man. Hey. You never know what you're going to get. After fast burp. You burp. You burp. Ah. They did have a flea issue. Which pet was it that had fleas in their house? But there's some missing hair here, and that's probably, yeah, and some irritation here. Fleas love this area. Let's hope she didn't come in with fleas, you know what I mean? It is possible to miss them. 
even after all that. Super soft though. Super duper soft here. All right, let's get her done. Let's get her done, how about it? Come touch some stuff up here. We're doing seven haircut, seven down, summer cut. Come touch up some of this. Now that the hair is nice and clean. Eighty-seven watchers, fifty-two likes. If you haven't liked the video, I was sure would appreciate it if you liked the video. Share it. <laughs> Share it on your social media. You can do hashtag my favorite groomer, and then I can see it as well. You see all the shares you do without having to dig too deep. Hashtag my favorite groomer. As you know, we are going to be grooming. Are you about to poop? You need to go potty? Uh, you got your tail in a weird way. I'm going to take her potty real fast. Come on. Let's take you potty real fast. I just have a feeling. Come on. I'm going to take you potty real fast. I got it. No, I got it. I don't want to lose her. All right. We'll be right back. I just have a feeling she needs to poo. Come on. Her tail. Looks like she's holding it. I know. There you guys. Uh, smash the like button. Support the stream. Um, like Gigi was going to say, I'm going to take this off. I'm not going to cut no more meat. <laughs> right. Um, we're going to be grooming in California. So if you guys know any people or know anybody that has a grizzly dog in California, please tell them to give us a call. We'll be in LA, LA area. So, my phone is up there. Well, we will be in LA, I believe so, next week. Next week. So, if you guys, later 20th of March. Yeah, I think it's going to be um, 24th, 25th-ish. Are you guys out of the leave in conditioner? It depends what, what leave in conditioner are you talking about? Dee Dee normally uses the stuff, which we're not out of that. But if you don't see any other kind, then that's, she, she's not, uh, she's really picky on what she has. So if we don't have it on the store anymore, that means that she did not like it. And we're not gonna sell it. How long are y'all in California for? We'll be in California probably for only four, four to five days. Around there. Beth, have you tried doing your nails outside on the Sunday? Did it? Happen. Nothing. Beth, no. It's not still, chilly though. She still has her. Um, it's considering I only have my smile. Are you and Vivi moving to LA? Who said that? Her? Laura. <laughs> going to say Yvonne said that? No. Not yet. Shoo, I wish. No, we're not moving to LA, but we are doing grooming in LA.
set. How's the lights coming? 69 out of 87. Not too bad. There, share the vid. Share the video, he says. Like we say, you guys, it doesn't matter if you have one follower or two followers. If you share the video, it helps us out. Share the video and do always do hashtag my favorite groomer in your share and your posts and stuff. Hey, Dee, what are you doing? Hashtag my favorite groomer. I can see that when I Google it. That's how that that's how that works. Hashtag is a pound sign. So if you guys share the video, that helps us out. So it helps us grow and help us reach more corners. Yeah. If you share, I would really like people in California to know. You know what I'm saying? And only uh, you guys can help me do that. There's a reason... And if you, e if you email me and say, Dee, Dee send me your tool list, I'll send you an email that has a lot of links on it from news stations and uh, things I've read and I found out and learned. There's a reason why someone wants me to come out to groom their dog. You guys might have the same reason. You guys might be like, we, I don't even get my dog groomed. I learn everything from you on, on YouTube. You know, there may be a reason you're doing what you do and you could put your story here. You know, my dog was this and that, my dog is sick, my dog was injured, My I don't trust somebody, I, you know, it takes too long. There's a reason why someone might say, you know, uh, I'd really like to get on a schedule in California, and I live in California. Um, Callie's folks are going to be groomed by me. Their pet is a husky, and they are going to, she's already prepaid for the groom, and she's in uh, two, her dad's going to drive two hours to have his pet groomed with me to support us but also because he really believes in what we do and you're not liking that. So your sharing goes a long way. Maybe that share, Hey, maybe that share helped Callie at one point find me who knows, but your share helps somebody. I promise you. You don't like your ears trimmed? Huh? No, you, didn't, you let me clean your ears just fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You're okay. I'm going to do the little bit of clone now. Come back to check the face with the scissors. Oh yeah, we can even try this scary cut tool. I don't use it a lot because I don't need to, but we've done uh, the how-tos on these guys because it's important for you guys to start somewhere. It's going to be really get that. It's going to trim only what's in the guard. It's going to trim only what's in the guard, right? As long as it's not knotted or matted, you're good. This is a great way, great place to start with your scissoring. If you don't know what you're doing, this is a great place to start. Uh, we sell them in a kit with some other scissors. Scissors will cut anything. So the guard helps you just as long as you can, as long as there's no knots, okay? Get in there and get all that done like that. Love that scary cut. Okay. But as a groomer, I have to know how to use some tools. <laughs> so here we go. We got our regular scissors out now. Yep. 
Let me see. I know you want to look the other way. Mm -hmm. No, look down. Don't do that. That's a bad position for you. No, no, we're not going to argue. We're not arguing. Oh, we'll change scissors on you, though. Go to the bubble tip curve. She wants to jump around like that. Just get your bubble tips out. Just to safeguard it a little bit more. See her looking the other way. She's trying to be bossy. It's not going to work. Just tighten up that leash a little bit. No. No. Nothing's ever happened to you here. We don't want it to start. Now, no. 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 See? Good. Very good girl. No. No. Good. Very good girl. Try, I don't have to shave down her muzzle if I've got this nice little, ah, ah, no, 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 no. Good, very good, very good. See, good girl, good girl. What are you doing with your jaw, huh? Is that a warning sign for me to watch out? All right, we're good to go here. Are you good to go? I'll tighten this up. All that gunky stuff, if you can see it, just get it all out, man. I don't know what it is, food or whatever. It's stuck in there pretty good. Let me see. Don't get upset. It's kind of stuff like this. Ear, ear, is that ear? Look at your ear standing straight. Boop, boop. <laughs> Look at her ear. All right, we got a couple minutes. I'll be right back before we head out for the day. Make sure you like the uh, smash the like button and share the video. I'll give you a couple minutes to do that before I get back. Take this, put you back here. Mom will be texted right now. Okay. Up. Oh. There we go. All right, let's do some uh, let's do some cleaning real fast here. Smash that like button, share the video, and we'll be right back with you. Give me a couple minutes to clean all this stuff up before I come back to a quick chit chat. Okay, let's see. Quick chit chat. be outside. I'm looking up here. Only 13 likes. Come on, guys. Jason, you're the best, man. Right? <laughs> Come on, guys, he says. Come on, man. <laughs> so true. So true, man. Uh, so David, you know, Dave, David's channel, and I'll get a notification. David's live, and I go, first thing I do is open it up, hit the like button, hit the share button, and go comment something. So I'm showing 80, like 81 likes. Look, that, that really pumped up some people right there, what we said, Jason. 